Well, Sharon, clearly Phil is taking some time off this week, but his <laughs> weekly segment called Phil Fills In continues. Today he takes us to a children's summer camp where he filled in as a camp counselor. Before we got started, a message from camp director Sarah Elliott. We've got ages 7 all the way to 10 and 11. A little nervous. You're basically just observing and kind of helping the kids with the activity. And on that note, it was time to meet the group. Everybody say good morning. Good morning. Good morning. After introducing myself, we leave yes. the gymnasium. Don't leave me hanging. Come on. Here we go. And get ready for arts and crafts. You guys want these? At this point, some of my fellow counselors told me I could participate too. What's your name again, man? Vargas? I'm going to sit down next to my man, Vargas. Vargas. All right. What do you got going on there, Michelle? That's great. And I quickly learned that arts and crafts time is also time for very, very serious conversation here at the summer camp. Which piece are you to when you play Monopoly? I the boot. I like being the boot too. Like you guys like the ship? No, I like the you go ship. I like. I, I grew my band over here. I like the boot. Once arts and crafts was over, it was back to the gymnasium for games. All right, here's it, cause the number's five. Today's game: sharks and fish. I joined Team Shark. Our goal: to tag all the fish. Here's one. Darn. You did, man. I'm old. He's faster than me. But for a day, I was more than just a camp counselor. Whew, I'm out of shape. I'll tell you that right now. Breaking a sweat and everything. I was able to be a kid again. In Chapel Hill, Phil Sanchez, WNCN Today. Looks like a lot of fun. Well, if you'd like to learn more about the summer camp program available through Chapel Hill Carborough City Schools, just log on our website, WNCN.com. You don't want to miss next week's Phil Fills In because he went to a defense class. See what happens when Phil fills in as an attacker. And if you have a job for Phil to fill in, shoot us an email at today at WNCN.com.